Lancelot Link, secret chimp. Stands for justice, he has no fear. He's the agent of call when trouble is near. Lance Link, you gotta come through. Everybody, it ain't discounting on you. Speed him out of heaven, an agent and a friend, and she'll stick by your side right to the end. Darwin is the leader on the side of the good. I jump ages like a good age. What you gonna do? You gotta stop the chunk, the job is up to you. Stand on the butcher, you better beware. He's into sand cunning and he don't play fair. He's got an evil chauffeur and Greedo's his name. And Dragon Woman's lovely, but she's wicked all the same. Old man Slink, what you gonna do when that Dr. Strange man comes up to you? There's Ali Assassin. Out West, strong, silent men still lead a simple, honest existence. But there are some whose lives remain dedicated to crime. The Banana Bunch. The evil Baron Von Butcher. And his faithful henchman, Crito. Get those chickens loaded! We roasted over a hundred head of chickens this time, eh, Baron? Excellent! Max schnell! The last crate, Pop! Well, that's enough chicken rustling today, boys. Where to, Pop? Back to the banana range! Oh. This was a good day's work, Grito. See, si, Herr Baron. Get going, match day. Lance Link, secret chip. The Lone Ape. As the wave of chump chicken rustling continued, ace crime-fighting agents Lance Link and Mata Harry headed west. Lance and Mata's mission, stop the rustling, or else. Or else what, Lance? Or else chump will control the take-home chicken industry. Oh, that's terrible. It sure is. Now housewives will be forced to cook dinner. Where do I start, Lance? At the Banana Ranch. And be careful, see? Later, at the ranch of the infamous Banana Bunch, the gang awaited the arrival of Baron Von Butcher. This is one game you're not gonna... Watch this move. I'm just gonna double jump you. Yep. Sure. Here comes the bird. Well, I watch it. Hey. Howdy, bird. Golden Tog. When are we going to rustle some more chickens? Today. Mmm. A big job? You won't have saw us the biggest. <laughs> While Mata was on her way to the banana ranch, Lance had arrived at the teepee of Ape's Indian agent, Leaping Frog. Thanks for the welcome. Smoke? No thanks, pal. I think I can live without it. Uh -huh. Say, what about the banana bunch? Many moon. Banana bunch steal kettle, take land. Speak with forked tongue. Banana bunch sheep no good. Mm. 
And nobody could stop them, huh? Only one man ride white horse, wear mask, him heap brave man. Is the masked man still alive? Yes, him now live with me. Old timer. <laughs> Hmm, that gives me an idea. Hmm. Out of yesteryear comes a fiery horse with the speed of light. With Leaping Frog as his faithful Indian companion and Lance posing as the great hero of the West, the masked rider rides again. What we do, Masked Rider? We'll just keep looking for the Baron and the Banana Bunch. Maybe rustling chickens, huh? Yeah, I sure hope Marta followed them. Not worry. I track them down. As Lance and Leaping Frog continued their search, the notorious Banana Bunch were on their way to rendezvous with... Baron Von Butcher. The Baron, in turn, was being followed by the relentless Mata Harry. Baron, we're being followed. Grito, catch up with the banana bunch. I have a plane. Schnell! What did you find, Leaping Frog? Oh, tire tracks. Tell me, what does that mean? They not travel by horse. Brilliant. Meanwhile, Mata continued her pursuit, unaware that the Baron had set a trap. Oh! God. Oh, no, no! Runtaba, tie her up and we will deal with her later. Do you uh, think we're near the rustlers? Oh, very close. That's amazing. How can you tell, uh, Leaping Frog? Very easy. Just look up. Me learn lesson. No look up when tracking. Mm. That takes care of your apes. Chump is going to rustle the last chickens in the West. See, si, Baron. And soon everyone will buy fried chickies from Colonel Chump. No use. Try to get free for hours. I was wondering, Leaping Frog, how would the Mask Rider get out of this? Me think Mask Rider probably have horse untie ropes, eh, Lance? No, Leaping Frog, it'll never work. It worked in cowboy movie. Here. He's coming. Untie the ropes, boy. Hey, Mata. Leaping frog, look. Whoopee! I'm free. Meanwhile, back at the banana ranch. Howdy! I give you my congratulations, Herr Banana Bunch. For the Baron, I'm much blood. But the villains wouldn't be so pleased if they knew at that very moment Lance had arrived with a plan. What's that? Turn them loose. Chicky, go. You all have done a fine job of rustling. I will mow you along now, fine. Yippee, 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 yippee,
Chicken's free now. We won. They lost. Well, it just goes to show you. Hmm. So what? Anyone who steals chicken <laughs> is a bad egg. Right now, I have something groovy for you. Groovy. It's a new recording group called Lancelot Link and the Evolution Revolution. So, for all of you young youngsters out there, here they are with one of their latest tunes. It'll be a really big show. Woo, 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 woo. Lancelot Link and the Evolution Revolution. <laughs> I'm Herman, and this is my little friend, Sherman. Say hi to everybody, Sherman. Now, say hello, dummy. Hello, dummy. My, you certainly think you're clever, don't you, Sherman? Uh-huh. Compared to you, I am. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm the boss, and you're nothing. Huh. Boss over nothing. <laughs> oh, stop that. Ew. It was a typical day at the beach where everyone had come to relax and enjoy the sun. Everyone, that is, except Baron Von Butcher and Dr. Strangemind of Chump. But nearby, observing the two arch criminals were Lance Link and Mata Harry, top agents of eight. Well, nothing suspicious yet. Hmm. Uh Mmm, horrible lake. Mm. Dr. Strangebind. Is it time? Yeah. Then I'll turn on my radio. What are they doing, Lance? Nothing. Just fiddling with the radio. That blew up just like the other ones did. Good work, Doctor! <laughs> yes, we did it. Hmm. We shall destroy every single one of the missiles. Mm, good move. Mm. Jump in again! Lance Link, secret chimp. 
Missile Beach Party. Later that morning, at the headquarters of the agency to prevent evil, Commander Darwin awaited the missile report. All right, you two, come in and sit down. I've got bad news. Another missile blew up. Before our very eyes. Oh, no, no. Say, what's your theory, Darwin? Hmm. My theory is the chump is behind the entire thing. I'm sure of it. Hmm. Uh, oh, pardon me, excuse me. Of course. But we were watching the Baron and Dr. Strange mind. Right, and we didn't see them doing anything at all. Well, now I know they're responsible, so stop them. We will. And stay alert, Link. This way, Lynn. Meanwhile, back at the beach. What's that? Huh? What's that? Ah, is that a missile? Guess not. Be patient, there will be plenty more. I wish to be more comfortable. Fix the beach chair. Und mach schnell. Hurry up. Certainly, Herr Baron. I find... What are you doing, you stupid? I am a genius. Yeah, a stupid genius. <laughs> Forget it. together a beach chair. I'll make you a bet that you will never be able to sit on it. Perfect. Hmm. One small step for the barn, one giant step for beach chairs. Don't be smart. Just look for missiles. In the meantime, Lance and Mata had returned, and, disguised as a hot dog vendor, Lance hoped to get close enough to learn Chump's missile-destructing secret. Hot dogs here, get your red hearts here, only 50 cents, get them all hot. I think we will have two of them. Okay, Buster, two red hearts coming up. Yes, sir. How about some mustard, fellas? Hey, uh, give it back, though, will you? Hmm. As the two chumps ate their hot dogs, Lance desperately looked for a clue. What are you doing there, you nosy vendor? Get away! Get out! Scram! Strange mind. Did this guy look familiar? Eh? Not to me. All hot dog vendors look alike. Well, the hot dog trick was a flop. Oh, I don't know. Oh, you found a clue? No. But I made a buck, huh? Oh. We've got to find out how they're blowing up those missiles. Say, I've got it. A good idea, huh? Well, tell me what it is. Hmm? 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 What's this? Property of Ape Athletic Department? 
She must be an ape agent. It's Martha Harry, grab her. You have to catch me first. Yeah. <laughs> After her. Marta's trick to lure the jump successful, Lance moved in quickly for the search. Well, there's nothing special around here but this portable radio. Looks like a nice one. AM, FM, and explode. Explode? So that's it. Let's see if we can turn the table on those chumps. I'll start with a few minor adjustments on this antenna. I know how to do it. Let me see. A little twist here. That girl runs fast. Like a bullet. Well, never mind. Another missile is due. You're right. Here it comes now. Ready, Dr. Strange Mind, huh? Yes, time for our favorite program. Oh, Lance, the missile's gonna blow up. Not yet. Now just watch. I know, I fixed it. Look! I don't have to, sweetheart. I know exactly where it's going. Half the missile! And it is coming at us! Run for your life! Bullseye, Marta. Bullseye. What happened? What happened, Baron? Everything suddenly went black. Congratulations, Lance. We beat Chum. The missile destroyed my exploder device. Yeah, and it ruined my monocle too. I hope those chumps learn their lesson, Marta. What lesson, Lancey Lad? Well, when you do something bad, it turns right back on you. Guess now, apes! You'll pay!